Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. We're back with Tower of Fantasy and this is gonna be <laughs> playthrough number 49. We uh, struggled to figure out how to get to this energy cave and what you need to do is open the map, pull up your cursor, Go over this number two, and if you look to the northwest of Inners, that's where you need to be. So we're gonna go and teleport to Inners Space Rift.
strange. I can't detect what's going on inside the cave at all. Is it possible that the signals in this area have been affected? I think Miss Lin mentioned that the Marzoid ore at the bottom of the sea can interfere with signal transmission. Then those patrol droids were definitely responsible for detecting abnormalities in the signal dead zone. Let's go and take a look inside these caves. What a headache. Inner seems to be in a more dangerous situation than I thought. Maybe it's the same in other caves. This must be one of the places which the Gray Space Entities come from. This group of Gray Space Entities is hiding in a blind spot where their signals can't be detected. Is it a coincidence, or did someone instruct them to do this? Not only that, the patrol droids nearby haven't sent any warnings to Inner's either. Or they may have, but the warnings were cut off by the interference, just like the detection signal. You mean that there are disguisers and inners participating in the conspiracy? We need more clues before we can reach a conclusion. Yes, we'd better do some research first. Go to Miss Wan Ling to learn more detailed information about these patrol droids first. What should we do with these gray space eggs? Destroy them now? It's unclear exactly how many gray space entities are hidden here right now. It's best not to do anything rash. Then let's go back to energy now. A great discovery, especially given the situation we're in.
Miss Wanling, we found traces of gray space entity activity in the waters around Inners. The nearby waters? Perhaps you've discovered a blind spot in our daily inspections. Could you please provide the detailed location data? The lair of the gray space entities is inside the Marzoid Ore Cave in the waters around Inners. Isn't that under the patrol droid supervision? We never received any relevant feedback. Because of this, we want to confirm the specific patrol and defense details of Inners. I'll check the relevant records. Don't leak this confidential information to unrelated persons. I've got it, and we'll look into it right away. <clears throat> Madam Fiona told me earlier that I must fully cooperate with both of you. I'll tell you everything you want to know. Since this is Madame Fiona's order, I'll fully cooperate. Mr. Lucius, a captain of the security force, is in charge of deploying patrol forces in the waters around Inners. In addition to performing routine inspections of the waters around Inners, the patrol droids will repeatedly survey some key areas based on the feedback from the MOOC squad. Lucius adjusts the patrol droids' inspection route every week according to the MOOC squad's findings. Only he, myself, and Madame Fiona know the specific arrangements. However, he's been on sick leave for the past two weeks, so Roy and I have taken the duty of arranging the routes. We completed the handover not long ago. Madame Fiona, we've lost contact with Mook Squad. <sighs> Where did things go wrong? I understand. Thank you. avoid the patrols of droids and the mook squad. We'll go ask Icarus and the others. <sighs> Mr. Icarus, we want to learn more about the mook squad patrol plan. Can you explain it to us? Yes, and we can discuss other relevant developments. Our patrol plan usually focuses on searching the areas where gray space entities are active based on their signals, unless Archon Fiona has other things in mind. The activity of gray space entities is usually illogical. We can only expand the scope of our investigation as much as possible and try not to miss any suspicious locations. Shira will focus on areas where she hasn't set up any detectors. She usually acts independently. But... Annie has made some unexpected discoveries recently. It's like this. I wasn't able to catch many gray space entities in the few days that the captain was away. They seem to be hiding from me. Ugh. I keep coming away empty-handed. I'm so angry. Are the gray space entities avoiding Annie? Melania, what do you think? When I was patrolling with... Miss... Annie... It was really... Yes, a strange phenomenon. It's like they were trying to lure me away on purpose. And they all scattered when I was about to catch up to them. Ugh. They better hope I don't get my hands on them! Um... Melania proposed that we should launch separate attacks, so we gave it a try. But... I don't know if the result of this experiment means anything. Well, when I patrolled alone, the gray space entities seemed to have lost the target they were focusing on. Come on. Am I really the one that scared away all those gray space entities? Yeah. We heard Archon Fiona say something about how gray space entity behavior has been more purposeful recently. Is there something special about Annie that the Gray Space Entities have noticed? 
Or is it? Penny, do you remember who performed the modifications on you when we came to Inars? I think that's a technician from the security force. What's her name again? It's... Nara. What's up? You mean when... Hmm. Could it have something to do with Annie's previous upgrades? Hmm? So what? Annie seemed to have gained many new capabilities after that upgrade, allowing her to receive Grayspace Entity signals more accurately. Is it possible that the Grayspace Entities are using this against us? Does it have positioning features or something? That's possible. But Miss Nara didn't mention this when she explained things to us. Did she just forget? Or is there another reason? We'll need to ask her about the specific details. Yes, we'll get to the bottom of this. just left and now we have two fresh faces let me <sighs> I'm so tired <sighs> work has been so busy I see this technical work is tough on the mind one word from director Glenn and I have to work overtime for several days director Glenn shouldn't it be mr. Lucius that talented tech department head came here to oversee the work. <sighs> Didn't he just come up with a way to improve the patrol droids? Now he has a bunch of new ideas for our information receiving system. It's easy for him to give the order. We have to work overtime for many days. What's the matter? I don't have much free time because he's about to verify the functions personally. I heard you were responsible for tuning and upgrading any from the Mook Squad? Mook Squad? Oh, I was the one who handled that. That girl is quite interesting. That combat chip that she equipped is amazing. It's probably some of my best work. Seriously, it's so cool. Sorry for interrupting you. You also gave her a positioning feature, right? Hmm? Was there such a thing? I'm not too sure, then. We just improved and upgraded the systems according to Director Glenn's instructions. Hmm... Maybe my clearance level is too low to know that she was given GPS features. Yes, that must be it. What? Is there something wrong with this function now? Jeez... The more troublesome the integration function, the easier it is for something to go wrong. If only I knew... Uh, no, everything is fine. We're just making sure. <sighs> so long as there's no problems. Can we check the location information of the Mook Squad from here? I'm afraid that won't work. You see, I don't know anything about it. This must be classified information that only those designated by Archon Fiona can see. Can you tell me about the improvements made to the patrol droids in more detail? I can't disclose the specific technical details. In short, with the strict quality control of our talented head, you don't have to worry about these patrol droids. <clears throat> well, Archon Fiona is planning on testing the performances of a random batch of patrol droids. Huh? Is this an urgent request from Archon Fiona? Then I'll deal with this first and send the report later. That should be all for now, right? I'll get busy then. We found. 
found many clues, but we don't seem to have enough to identify a specific candidate. Let's share what we have with Archon Fiona first. Executor, Shirley, you're here. We were just discussing the situation of Domain 9 with Miss Lon. Seems that you've also brought lots of important intel. Archon Fiona, we found a hatcher lair in the Marzoid Ore Cave in the waters around Inners. Hatcher? Is it a type of grace space entity that has catalytic abilities? Sure enough, they're here on Vera too. I remember that place is a blind spot in the detection of Grey Space Entity signals. We specially arranged patrol droids to conduct daily inspections there. But based on the current situation, Inners hasn't received any warning about them. Could someone have hidden the warning messages? In addition, we've also found other unusual behavior related to Grey Space Entities. The Mook Squad told us that some Grey Space entities seem to be deliberately attracting their attention to make them change their patrol route. They would lure the Mook Squad to a suspicious location and leave before they arrived, often making any go there for nothing. This undoubtedly reduces the search efficiency by a lot. But it sounds like the Grey Space entities could keep track of the whereabouts of the Mook Squad. Yes. We suspect that this may be related to the positioning system on any. Huh? Are you saying... This is a very serious accusation, given that not many people know about this. Harkon Fiona! I've got something extremely important to report! The behavioral logic of the patrol droids you commanded was modified. They, 
They now see all Grayspace entities as harmless sea creatures. I understand. Recall all the patrol droids now and correct all the errors in their behavioral logic. Yes, Lieutenant Roy is already working on this. I'll go and help him now. It's time for everyone to discuss this together. Looks like you already have an answer. Glenn, has there been any progress in the analysis of the abnormal signals Ms. Shiro found? Harkon Fiona, you don't need to worry about that. It's just something caused by the normal activities of marine creatures. I don't think we should waste our effort on meaningless research. Oh? The abnormal signals have nothing to do with the Grey Space Entity's activity? Do you have any evidence of that? This... Uh, their activities just happen to coincide with those of Grey Space Entities. Or did you mistake the activity of Grey Space Entities for the activity of normal creatures? After all, I just learned that the behavioral logic of the patrol droids has been maliciously tampered with, leading them to identify Grey Space Entities as marine creatures. Lucius, what do you think? What? I didn't know anything about this. When did it... It must be a hacker. Maybe someone with ulterior motives hacked into the droid's management intranet. I'll investigate this matter thoroughly now. That's right. Maybe I... It was my negligence. The situation is so tense that any loophole may become a fatal weakness. Lynn told me earlier that they found a type of gray space entity called Disguiser, which has the ability to parasitize humans. The host will become the puppet of the gray space entities. Maybe it was this Disguiser who secretly destroyed the defenses of Inners. Puppet of the gray space entities? I got it! I figured it out! You've intentionally overwritten the patrol droid's judgment on gray space entities by tampering with their behavioral logic. As a result, they wouldn't find any enemies no matter how many times they patrolled the hazardous areas. During the two weeks when you were sick, your evil plan could still be carried out covertly even if we took over your work. No. You actually are pretending to be sick. If anyone traces it back to you, that sick leave would be your best excuse. Roy. You're being reckless. We've been blinded by the facade. That's exactly what the Disguisers want. It was my mistake. What is Glenn's condition? Will the Disguiser have any adverse effects on him? He should wake up soon, but he still needs to be isolated and observed for a period of time. Okay. Wanling, please take care of him. The previous reports of the patrol droids are completely meaningless now. We need to conduct new investigations on what's really going on in that area. Okay, leave this to us. Okay. Guys, I'm gonna have to cut this one a little bit shorter. I will catch you guys in the next one. Don't forget to smash those buttons. Until then, catch you later.